this car, in the hands of both Chas Mostert and Lee Holdsworth, has consistently been the fastest on average all week. And in fact, when you run across the sessions thus far, that's what the numbers suggest. Now, is that going to be the case at the critical moment? Chas Mostert, car 25, Mobile One Appliances Online Racing, two minutes, 3.9770 for him to be able to get in. He was a winner in 2014 in one of the most extraordinary motor races in the history of the business. Third and on the podium last year. He got a pole position by default to a degree in 2019. Championship position so far this year, sitting in fourth. He's had an armour all pole at Sandown, a couple of wins in Tassie and Darwin. Eight times he's grabbed a spot on the podium. That looked pretty nice through turn two at Griffins. He stays in third gear and runs it out of revs to the rock face at turn three. Cutting looked good too, Mark. Beautiful. Oh, no space on the exit. Here comes the shift into third. Nice. That was stable, very stable. This thing's been a dream. It's adjusted beautifully so far. This wow. is in the hands of both drivers. And that was off the scale. Check the number out, 50.4719. Mozzie's on fire over the top of the hill. He's done the best job that we've seen so far. And the crowd lights up and loves it up the top. Plunging off the top. The Eastern Ridge Line looking towards Sydney. His eyes are focused on the dipper. The Kazoo Racing Dipper, two wheels and out the other side, third gear. Back up to 180 kilometres an hour. Blind approach to Forest Elbow, feet at second gear. The car is incredibly stable. Here comes the second indication as this to whether good. it's a good lap, and it's a 32.5. He's only one one hundred slower over the top of the mountain than Brody Kostecki. But the cumulative time, better than anybody else out there at the moment. Mostert might grab another pole at Bathurst. What's it going to look like when he gets to the bottom of the chase? It's been beautiful in the hands of Lee Holdsworth and Chas Mostert all week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday morning. On the direction change, it looks just as strong. They're watching at Tickford. They're watching at WAU. The critical stop. The nose plunges under pitch. The back of the car is stable. He hits the apex, and this is going to be very close for Mostert, and he's done it. He's done it two minutes. Well done, buddy. Well done. And that's the best ever number that we've seen in a top 10 shootout. That is a staggering move by Chas Mostert. That is unbelievable. Fastest lap ever in qualifying at this venue. And that car has been a rocket all weekend. A 3-3-7. Wow, check this out. There's not a skerrick of road left anywhere. Chaz, Mark Scaife, that was one of the best laps I've ever seen you put on. Oh, man, that was so much fun. Woo! <laughs> it's not that haircut, is it? Oh, I don't know, man, but if it is, I'll tell you what, it's going to be staying around for some time. <laughs> <laughs> a little bump on the fence coming out of Forest Elbow there. Yeah, well, it was a little bit too good, so I thought I'd just scratch it up a little bit for the boys. Good work, mate. That was an incredible lap. You should be really proud of yourself. Well done. Thank you.